So I did a review that was like, just like a Canva review of this. But I wanted to do like a little video review too. It was really a three out of five. I wish that she had focused more on the love story and building the love story than trying to like add the plot in there too. Or just like work on this book a little bit more. Like this is my first Allie Hazelwood book. I have not read one book from this lady. It's okay if you love her. It's okay if you love her books. But I have not read one book from this lady. So then this is my first book reading from her. And I'm just like, oh, this felt very much like a time passer. I don't feel like I was really connected to any of the characters. Um, Spice Leia. Spice level was mayo with dog schlong. We've already went over this, like I said, in that other review. I, I really wanted to like this, but I, uh, I just struggled. I struggled and I had this on fast forward because I just didn't care by the end. By the end of it, I was like, ugh, like, let the, let the book just go. Let the book just rest. Let the book be in peace. And like, I wish I liked it. I really didn't. It wasn't for me. It wasn't written for me. This was written for somebody else and somebody else will love this. Somebody else will rate it five out of five. Somebody else will enjoy this, but this was really not it for me. This isn't even like, oh, this isn't the best Omegaverse book I, I've read before. It's more like, mm, meh. Meh, 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 meh. like just based on the book, just based on like the fantasy elements of it, you, you know why I think I really didn't like it? And I posted this in my other review. It just, it felt like Twilight, Twilight characters in Crescent City. It felt like Bella was the main character and she was a vampire and Edward was a werewolf. And this was kind of like a fan fiction written in the Crescent City world. And that's not a bad thing. If you like those two fandoms, that's okay. I used to like Twilight. I used to like Twilight a lot. But literally, literally, this book just felt like I was trying. I was struggling. I was limping to the finish line. I was just fucking struggling, you know what I mean? And I hate being negative about a book, but it's just, fuck, dude. Like, just the cover got me. And I was so, I was so ready to love this book. I was like, this is going to be a five out of five. I'm going to love it. This is, the concept has me. This is a marriage of convenience. I love that shit. I love me just like a marriage just because it's a marriage. They're going to fall in love just because they're going to fall in love. Give me any romance book with fantasy elements and I'm going to be like, I hope they fall in love. I love that sh I love when characters fall in love. Like, I'm rooting for them the moment they start looking deep into each other's eyes. And they're like, let's do this. I didn't really feel that. Like, I felt there were some connections. But I was like, ah, oh, no. I feel like she should have gone in with the bodyguard, to be honest. The bodyguard would have been a better selection. And then some of the twists. Like, she was trying to add twists. She was at trying to add turns. I'm like, you don't need to do all that. Girl, you don't need to do, take that out. Take all those twists out. We don't care. Just, if you're going to have dog schlong, give us dog schlong. And then just, that's it. We're weird. We're fucking weird out here. We love that weird shit. All you got to do is dog schlong. If you're going to do a nodding scene, just do a nodding scene. Don't add any twists, turns, final action scene. I don't need any of that. Just have them fall in love. That's it. In a romantic setting, have them fall in love. I don't need the murder mystery aspects. I don't need any of that. So yeah, three out of five. You can have a differing opinion. You don't have to have the same opinion. This probably didn't add anything to like my last review. But like, it's it was okay. Like I had this on in the background most of the time and I was just like, I don't feel connected. I really do not feel connected to any of the characters. And like I said, this isn't even an Omegaverse thing. It's just like, I don't know. It felt like she was experimenting and it's like, pop off, girl. Good for you. But I don't know. Give this a few more years. Experiment some more, but on a fan fiction website. 